hi again everybody um, I'm coming on right now because I wanted to bring some people up to date as to what's happening with House of the Unusual the company has been in business for quite some time and I've been selling the same novelties from comic books uh, since 1985 uh, what I'm planning to do now is I have kind of I'm involved in, in a couple of projects coming up one of those projects is going to be Acme House Novelties. Uh, it's a combination between me and David Harversat from uh, SS Adams. Uh, the original SS Adams company, the one with the snake and the nut can and the joy buzzer. We're, uh, we're going to be putting together uh, four original items from the 1970s. And when I say putting together, we've already introduced them. Uh, I'm going to make them go live September 1st. Uh, one of them is we, I have uh, with him we have reproduced the original seven foot Frankenstein monster uh, from the comic book, the green one. Uh, we've done it in a one piece uh, and it's printed on outdoor vinyl. Um, it, it's awesome. It's, it's a really nice looking piece. It took many hours to put together. Uh, it was so hard to not just duplicate the actual image from the plastic, the two-piece plastic, but then combining them into one large piece was excruciating. That was one of the hardest things I've done in a long time. But I was able to reproduce it in original color and everything with David. Uh, I combined forces because David has the forces overseas to do it. He knows people. He has... Um, his company, SS Adams, dealt with China, and, and you know, and it was a lot easier. I've never really dealt directly with too many of them, so I don't have the same connection he has. Together, we combine our our specialties, which he specializes in certain things. I specialize in other things, and we come out and we introduced the seven foot Frankenstein. I'm actually going to be posting um, some photos and links of the videos that we we did together with the Frankenstein. And for the first time ever, since 1969, I guess, I reproduced the original lenticular hypnocoin. So you guys are going to be able to purchase the original hypnocoin with the 25 lessons in hypnotism, you know, the, the pamphlet that was offered by um, the... American Circle Corp was one of the biggest companies that offer it. It was also offered by Johnson Smith and by a company in New York. The original coin was made by Vary View. Vary View was very famous back in the 1960s when they produced uh, coins that people put up, like, you know, kind of like those buttons uh, for John F. Kennedy when he became president. Richard Nixon would say vote, and then when you turn, the image would turn into the president and so forth. But then they developed the original. Hypno coin. Now, to make my hypno coin different from that original, uh, me and David, we, we had it done at, at a, you have a, a two and a half inch uh, disc. So the coin itself is a lot larger than the original. Um, I'm going to be posting photos on that. When I mean a lot larger, it's just like a quarter, qu quarter inch or less, a little larger. It's going to have the original. Uh, 25 lesson pamphlet that came with it. Uh, I was going to introduce it as a set with the original 25 lessons in hypnotism, but I, I've sold that book for years now, and, and I figured, you know, I want something new. No one's ever had the flyer. Um, on eBay, they're going for $125, and it's insane. People are paying it. Um, we're going to have a really fabulous startup price. I think it's, uh, you guys are going to enjoy this. So, House of the Unusual is still House of the Unusual. Uh, it's going to continue to uh, to be there. Um, the only thing that I am doing is um, I'm I'm doing a couple of projects, like I said, with David, and and you know I want to do. Uh, I'm working on another project, but that's that's something I'm not going to mention right now because I'm not sure how that's going to turn out, but. You know, the original items that House of the Unusual has been selling will continue to be sold. I'm going to cut down right now on, on most of the items because I need some time to work with David. Uh, once we launch Acme House Novelties and people start, you know, 
recognizing the company in a couple of months or so, I'm going to dedicate more time to House of the Unusual because House of the Unusual is a trademark company. It's been around since 1985. I'm not just going to go ahead and, and skip out of it. No, and, and still, I'm still producing, but there's certain things that I don't have within my power to produce because uh, it's hard. You need big manufacturing companies. You need, uh, you know, stuff. Well, David has that, and, and he's able to produce things I couldn't. So in combination with him, uh, there's certain things that House of the End User is going to put out, and there's a specialized line that Acme House Novelty is going to put out. Either or, I'm involved with the two of them. So, you know, it's still me behind it and David now. And it's, you know, it's, 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 I love working with David. He's one of the greatest guys I ever met. Uh, we, we've known each other for almost, gosh, 30 years now. Uh, we finally, we always talked about it, but never actually launched it. This is the first time we actually went together and, and launched the product. In fact, he actually was one of the guys that helped me put together the original uh, Polaris nuclear submarine that I think there's like seven or 8,000 views already for this video that I, a lot of people were angry because they wanted me to put it together. I'm like, why would I put together the original submarine that's still immaculate you know that would be i know it would be great to put it together in front of camera and people love to see the unboxing and you know what but i don't care how many thumbs down they give me that's not going to happen um i will have it maybe reproduced soon uh it's it's a costly thing and and i don't you know the demand is there but i'm not sure how how, how that even is going to take place for now but anyway the point is, what I was saying is that the Acme House Novelty is going to be launched September 1st. Uh, we're getting things ready right now, so I kind of took off all my auctions at eBay. Uh, I shut down my Etsy store. House of the Unusual .com, um, has been in a third party uh, company. And not a third party, but I've used a third party uh, to fulfill the orders and stuff. And a lot of the orders are not coming to me. Uh, they're not being fulfilled and you know I need to redo the website now I was gonna do that I actually did the a new website but when I you know launched it and changed the name over or the I redirected the house of the unusual to the new site I lost a lot of the original grandfather stuff I had in um, in you know in in the internet so i i left it back and i'm trying to figure out how that's going to be but anyway for now i just thought i'd bring you up to date thank you very much